Hey everybody, it's me, Nevis Toaster, and welcome to the Turing Test. Uh, this is a game that a friend of mine told me that I really had to play because it's supposed to be kind of like a mix of the Talos Principle and Portal. And I really like those games. And it's supposed to be puzzles and cool and just neat all around. And I've had it for a while and I really need to get on it and do this. Good morning, Tom. Your wake-up has been sanctioned by the ISA. Wonderful. We lost contact with the ground crew 450 hours ago. We have tried to establish further communications, but we are not getting any responses. I'm glad that you're allowing me to wake up, by the way. That's a great sanction to have. We need you to investigate. Okay, doesn't it make sense to do visual checks first? We have already looked at the data. The ISA has made the executive decision that you report to the surface post haste. Chip chop. You are our emergency response. Oh good. What exactly is the emergency? The ground crew found an organism the ISA believed to be dangerous. We need to re-establish communication. With the organism? Sure, I can do that. I'm good with organisms. Take that coffee. Nope. Okay. Well, um, ooh, I love that when they do that effect. When I'm looking right into the light, everything else gets a little darker. Eyes gotta adjust. But, uh, wow. Ooh. So shiny. So sparkly. Oh, I thought that was a window as well. Well, there's an arrow. Thank you. I appreciate that. That's a fan. This is still a hallway. Ava turning. Cryogenic awakening. 2250. It is the future! Good. Good to know. So, Sarah Brooke. Kale, user error. I can't wait to find user error. Everything's locked. So I got a team of people, and they want me to go find them, huh? Hmm. That's an office. It seems like they are loading things in as you walk up to it, though. So that Pick seems. Pick up your that, EMT. Uh, it's Electro magnetic tickling device or testicle. I don't okay. know. We are going to take a lander to Europa. Make your way to the docking station. Okay. Can I... Um, energy manipulation tool. Okay, that's... There we go. Thank you! Okay, where's the spaceships? This way to spaceships? This is an office I can go in. Is this my office? Oh, I got a laptop. Nope, can't use it. I can just... Check out my laptop, baby! That's what I do. That's how I use my computer when I get laptops. Fuck this flashlight's not useful other than that. Just to play with. Here we go. Hmm. To Ava, the current ship status is as following. Uh, don't care about that. Hey, Dan, I'm about to initiate cryostasis. Uh, best of luck down there. Hopefully you won't need to wake me. Hopefully we won't need you. Unless you're on the land of the living. Right from Dan, Captain McLean has sent several mails insisting I check the cryo chambers functioning. If functioning normal, please do not feel apprehension. I should be woken up in ten years. Well, shit! Why would you be asleep for so long? Hmm, interesting. Let's uh, open it up. And down I go. I don't have to do any of this. It's all automated. That's awesome. Just like the future. Future! Games play themselves. What? Hey. Hey. Now how do I get you again? What if I don't want to stay down here? I'm stuck now. I can't jump. Look at me. Look at it. I jump like a fat man who's been jumping already a lot. What's the ship's status? I have performed the necessary checks. The Europa lander is ready to launch. Okie dokie. What do we got here? I think that's everything wound up, Tom. It yes. hurts. Well, I guess I'm ready to go down for the long sleep then. Good night, Ava. I will miss your assistance. The ship will be very quiet without you here. Night. See you when I wake up, Tom. She must have been the pilot or something. Residuals before nulling. Minus zero two, minus zero four, minus zero one. X and Z null to zero. Looking good. Okay, good. Horizon check right on time. How's things, Christopher? Good. I have go. Power to send. I can confirm. 
You are go for power descent. Roger that. I am running the PDI program. 80 degree delta pitch to 88 degrees absolute. Breaking procedure. Engine one ignition. Engine burn. They're, they're landing. Alarm. The landers are ready. Good. Thanks, Tom. You okay now, Sarah? Yeah, I think so. Thank you, Daniel. I've done this before. I'm sure you'll be fine. It's just another ten years of my life. So, that was uh, them landing and saying goodbye to friends. I wonder if when they went into stasis they actually aged the ten years. I wouldn't want to ever do that. If that was the case, I wouldn't want to lose ten years of my life. I mean, I wouldn't mind, like, skipping 10 years and staying where I was at, but that looks really cool. Oh, that's really cool. But yeah, it doesn't seem like it would be, um, worthwhile to just lose 10 years if that's the case. Well, can't really see anything out there except space. Otherwise, I would have taken a good hard look. Ooh, it's a pod. I'm gonna be a pod man, lady. Come on, don't make the fucking... It's all clunky in the fucking cinematics. Come on, I want this to be smooth. Smooth as butter is what I want. Wow, that's disorienting. Metro. Go. Fido. Go. Guidance. Go. Control. Go. Telcom. Go. Then we are go for launch initiated. You go! So Engaging retrofire. I'm running the program. 80 degree delta pitch to 88 degrees absolute. Breaking procedure. Trajectory looks good. 502 alarm. It looks like we're coming in too fast. We are slightly short of the landing site. We are going to have to burn late. Go. Full retrograde. There's no way you could do that manually. I'm sorry, no way. Open the door. Welcome to Europa. Yay, Jupiter moons. Go on. If that thing could land there, you can too. Okay. And here I am. Welcome to Europa. And the ISA. I don't know what that's going to stand for. I'm not even going to make a try at it. So how are you? This. Okay, abrupt loading screens. I'll have to watch for that. Well, I guess now I've got a gun here. Buzz, buzz, buzz. Oh, okay, whoa. Hey, fuck you, laser grid. The base has changed. What do you mean? The base was originally constructed as modules to withstand the seismic activity in and around Thera Magnum. It appears the ground team have manipulated these modules. Okay, interesting. I don't know why would they do that though. Any reason? Is that charging the base my was gun? Built initially by machines. I served as the mind of these operations. I arrived first on Europa in 2240. Okay. It costs a lot to send humans into space with the necessary life support, especially such a vast distance from Earth. Yeah, that makes so, sense. Robotics built this place. Ooh. That's cool looking. So that probably clears out any energy that's in my gun I or something. I wonder why the ground team has changed these rooms. I have a hypothesis. These rooms are Turing tests. Turing tests? 
Turing tests are tests designed to tell humans and machines apart. Typically, problems only solvable by a human. A combination of logical and lateral thinking. So, you can't complete these tests, Tom? No. That is why, why I am glad you are here to help. We need to work together. Uh, did they, but why would they... They really have completely repurposed these rooms. I am quite impressed. So, what were they used for before? Most of them were used for storage. But they have converted them beyond recognition. Perhaps they ran out of things to do out here. The devil makes work for idle hands. But my first question would be, why would they have done this at all to try and keep machines out of these rooms to begin with? Like, what would a threat of machines be? Because, let's be honest, it's just seems foolish. Uh, do you know the ground team's location? The crew are deeper inside the base, it seems. They must be trying to survive. Can you find their precise location? I'm afraid not. I am working to regain control. Though I once had complete control of this base, a lot has changed in the past 500 hours. No, okay, I got it. I was just a guess, originally. Oh, come on, I can't get it from here? Is that what I needed to do? Is there only one movable one? Yeah, okay. So certain ones you can move and certain ones you can't. That's really cool, too! So if this base is managed by you, why can't you find the crew? The base's communication array is malfunctioning. But why? Perhaps we can't solve this yet. Oh. Fuck it, then I'm just taking it. More than likely, it's not gonna let me take it, is it? Nope, it is not. Okay. This is really neat! I like it already! Wait a minute. Hold E. And do that, yeah. No, drop it over there. Thank you. Oh, well. There's a green one. Is that cool? Oh. This doesn't add up. What does not add up? If there was an accident, surely they'd come to find me, not try to lock me out. That's a good point, too. My instance is still resolving conflicts. I expect they have their reasons. Nope, I'm gonna put... Sorry. I'm gonna go there. You're gonna go in there. I'm gonna go over here, and I'm gonna steal you, gonna put you back in there, and then away we go. Cool. Well, you know what? I'm gonna call it here for now, and we're gonna keep going through this, and we're gonna get the story, uh, take as much time as we need. So I'm sure puzzles are gonna get a lot more complicated. Uh, maybe I'll have some people on that'll enjoy it with me. Uh, guess when I... It's all, all dependent on what you wanna see, and how much of this I wanna play in a row. So, thank you all for watching. I'm Devious Toaster. This is the Turing Test, and I hope you're enjoying it as much as I am. I'll see you guys next time. Okay. I like the music too, it's really good. It's a lot of error codes, thanks for that. Fine, here's your Jiggly's back. Okay, nope, that's bad. Code.